Welcome back, back to Death to Spies. We begin today the Hotel mission, simply called Hotel. Not normal difficulty, of course. <clears throat> what do you have to say to us today, Mr. Man? I forgot his name. Oh, yes. The Gestapo always knew how to treat people. <laughs> Only in the very end, we realized that all missions had been either overdone or underdone. We understood that war was a part of life, an unexplainable part. Mm, indeed. It could never be successful. At the beginning of a mission, a scout is like a child who does not know what would become of him in his old age, and he must be ready for the worst and trust himself only. Live for today, if it ever comes, of course. Comrade Lieutenant Colonel, excuse me. You have a call. It's urgent. Now he's just going to remember a past mission. Or two. Ah... <laughs> uh. Pretty weird thing to do, really. Anyway, Hotel Metropole. Find and kill the mole. According to our data, one of our people have been supplying the British Intelligence Service with information through a diplomat. As we have learned from our sources, the next meeting is to take place in the Liberty li Library of a hotel. <laughs> Uh, we need to learn... Oh, that's a big W. We need to learn who the mole is and confirm that he has passed the documents to the diplomat. Then the traitor is to be killed in a noiseless manner so that the diplomat does not notice anything. Then we must replace the documents. After the transfer of the documents, the, you are to follow the diplomat and replace the documents with our disinformation. <laughs> I see falsifying documents, eh? I like that idea. <laughs> uh anyway, we will just kill one person in this mission. Right? I hope. <laughs> I hope we can do this peacefully. Yeah. Okay, okay, let's go. Oh boy. Now that's an outfit we haven't seen since Mafia. Uh, uh, let's see, the first thing we need to do... Uh, let's see, we, we have... Uh, lock picks and a choke cord. That's all we have. Uh, hmm. Ah yes, I think we need to uh, sign in. Just wait for the guy to get back. <laughs> oh. Ooh, chess, eh? That's interesting. Come on, man. Ah, there he goes. And comes. Hi there. I, uh... Wait, don't we need an item? Oh, wait. Ah, that's better. You need to stand there. Settle in the hotel. <laughs> uh, this place kind of reminds me of the Corleone Hotel. A hotel visitor's card has been acquired! Woohoo! We can now do more than simply sightsee. That is, walk around! Um, ah yes, what we'll want to do, very quickly... Our very first objective... Uh, there's the diplomat over there in the blue suit and red tie. Although almost everyone in this place has a red tie. These are the security. Don't they look like men from the Mafia? <laughs> uh, what we need to do is quickly go into the library, yeah? It says library there. <laughs> okay. Very good. Now that guy, no, not that guy. Well, 
We will watch from over here. A safe place, yes? Um... Well, a guy who has the files, the traitor, in fact, will come along and place uh, the documents over there on that shelf. Then the diplomat will grab them. Now, if we just stay here nice and calmly, they shouldn't know a thing. Even though that diplomat... <laughs> Why are you looking at me? And nobody else. Am I special? Do I have something on my face? Hmm. Well, you are wearing a hat that no... Oh wait, that other guy is wearing the same hat as well. Okay. Forget about that. You know, I think I might increase the volume a bit. <laughs> Again. Maybe about there and there and there, I guess. That should do, I hope. <laughs> the music in this level isn't half bad. Okay, the traitor has placed the documents. And the traitor is wearing a brown uh, jacket. A brown suit. With a re uh, hmm. Well, that doesn't matter. The diplomat has acquired the documents. <laughs> okay, our tasks have changed, have they? Um, ah, yes. Find the weapons. Find the weapon. It has been transferred to the hotel in a box filled with newspapers. The parcel is in one of the utility rooms. Yep. Silence revolver. Our favourite. Now, we should get out of here, because... In a few moments, the traitor will know who we are. And, well, then things will start getting shot up, won't they? Uh, what, what's the first thing we have to do again? Ah, yes. <laughs> we need a chef's uniform. Oh, yes. <laughs> uh, but we have to do this just right. We only have one shot, and all the shots we want in a quick save. <laughs> so, fear not, fear not. Here is the kitchen, of course. No one travels down this corridor, I believe, so it's okay. I will just save it, just to make sure. Oop. Okay. Now, what we want to do is crouch. Then, quick save. Okay. Careful, we need to sneak over here. There are guys over there. Now, wait for the chef. Ooh! <laughs> Wait for the chef. <laughs> there, the, those plates are in a very precarious position, you know. Okay, the chef is going in. Come on, knock it over. Okay, good. Those guys will go over there. Oh, while we go in here. And, um, sorry, guy, but I really, really need your, uh, yeah. Oh, hey, no, you don't! Uh, oh, jeez, they heard that, didn't they? Yep, they heard that. Grrr! Stupid chef, you cost me the mission by turning around! <laughs> Look at them! Who do they think they are? Guards? Oh. Uh, um... Uh... Hey, hey, don't... <laughs> uh, what have 
I doing? I need to, I, I over here really would like to close this door, you know? Um, so... Uh, this... I've never been in this situation before. Oh, the chef is cowering now because he heard us. <laughs> Every chef fears Semyon now because they know that they aren't safe from his punches. And now they're going to shoot at us. So we'll be right back. Um, after I have, uh, well, reloaded.